a good bit of talk there lately about small businesses going out of business because of rising costs. I've seen certain small business owners for whom I feel a great degree of sympathy on the news and on the radio and elsewhere complaining about rising costs and the rising costs been the cause of the business going out of going out of business. Whether it's a coffee shop or a restaurant or whatever. I've seen Adrian Cummins from the Restaurant Federation also attributing raising costs to the cl closure of various restaurants and various members of his organisation, the Restaurants Federation. And I think that this argument is untenable. It is, quite frankly, nonsense. Costs have always risen. Since time immemorial, since the first business got the show on the road, entrepreneurs have always been faced with rising costs. My argument is that if your business is on such a fine edge that rising costs are going to put you out of business, then there's something fundamentally wrong with your business, with your operating model. Because as I say, costs have always risen. Prices have always risen. Fee income rises. Prices in the supermarket rise. Restaurant prices rise. Coffee shop prices rise. This is inevitable. And that is why we have the consumer price index. Consumer price index is a basket of goods that economists use to measure inflation. What's inflation? Rising prices. So costs rise and it's fundamentally unsound and untenable in my view to try to attribute rising costs as the concept or as the reason for failure of a small business because as I say as sure as day follows night costs will rise and if your business model is so tightly so finely balanced on an edge that rising costs are going to tip it over and put it out of business well then you have a bad failing business model I'm in business since 1986 when I was 23 I've had ups and downs I've had good ones I've had bad ones but inevitably I've always accepted and been ready for rising costs and I've always tried to build in a little bit of margin into every business to allow for that to allow for the good times being able to outweigh the bad times and if the business can't do that if the business is unable to give sufficient margin to carry you over through the bad times when costs might inflation might rise a bit more than you might anticipate if your business can't sustain that then fundamentally as i say your business is not on a sound footing it's on quicksand and you really need to find another business or another way of operating that's what entrepreneurs do don't go running to the government don't go running to the state don't go running to the taxpayer for a bailout or for more money Look at your own business model and accept that from time immemorial costs rise. Hope you find this video useful. If you're wondering what that that dough is, that dough is sourdough. A sourdough loaf with it's made with a rye sourdough starter. That's completely rye flour. It's a sort of a, a dark or black flour. Very, very popular in Eastern Europe for rye bread and so on in Russia and places like that. And it's got rye starter, rye flour starter, and it has some pumpkin seeds and some walnuts in it just to just to uh, spice it up a little bit without going overboard. Hope you find the video useful. If you do, I'd appreciate if you give it a thumbs up down below. And you may be interested in subscribing to my YouTube channel or my podcast, The Irish Law, a small business podcast, which you can access on Spotify, iTunes, or anywhere you might listen to podcasts. Thanks a lot.